Very few people are living their lives based on a matter of service, and then ultimately you make relationships and connections, and that grows to grow your business and your life and community. Well, he created an actual event called ServeX, and I asked him for a couple of minutes to come up and share his thoughts. Put your hands together, Manny Lopez. Um, well, my story kind of starts off, uh, I was 18 months, and it's cold winter, I have nothing but a diaper on, and I'm left in a car with my sister who's 11 months older than me. We're abandoned, left in a car, and the police report says we had looked like we'd been living in that car, and that the diapers had been soaked for days. At that point, I was put into foster care, I was adopted and returned seven different times like an unwanted birthday toy. My sister was also adopted with me. Luckily, we stayed together through this entire ordeal where we suffered everything from abuse, malnutrition, torture, and even neglect. I had a scar on my chest from being held down at two years old as I was throwing a tantrum where my foster parent ended up lighting, lighting up a cigarette I'm burning my chest with it. You see, there's a lot of these things that are happening not only 20 years ago, but today in the foster care system. You see, when these kids turn 18, they have this thing called aging out, where you're just basically on your own. You get some resources and things like that, but here's what happens. Two out of three of these kids, within one year of leaving the foster care system, they're either dead, homeless, or in jail. Because they have, they're missing what saved me. Mentorship and entrepreneurship. You see, what's allowed me, yeah. what's allowed me to be able to create the success I have today, which being featured in the magazine, being named one of the best by Facebook and the Hidden Million Advertisers, being able to work with amazing leaders in business like Les Brown and, and Sharon Lecter and Greg Reed and all these amazing people I surround myself with because what my mentor, my first ever mentor told me was back in 2008, he said, you should be listening to this guy named Les Brown. He's an orphan just like you. He's, he was labeled mentally challenged just like you. He had to live a very rough life, very similar to you, but look at him. He's a decamillionaire, he's having major success, he's filled stadiums with over 80,000 people in them just to hear him speak. You can learn something from this guy. So I started listening to him. I started figuring out what I can do to learn how to be successful. And mentorship and entrepreneurship saved me. Mentorship allowed me to unlock my potential. Entrepreneurship allowed me the freedom to see that opportunity and create it for myself. Because being through the foster care system, being an orphan, it's really lowering your self-esteem a lot because a lot of these times you're just nothing more than a paycheck to these foster parents. And so I created this event called Servex, where it's a way for me to collaborate with entrepreneurs, industry leaders, and all while raising money for kids in foster care. A hundred percent of whatever we raise, whether it's sponsor money, whether it's ticket sales, I literally come out of pocket a lot of money to put these on because I want to see people that are getting the education of what is going on in the foster care system. And I actually have a big goal. My goal is within five years from now, two out of three of these kids will not be dead, homeless, or in jail. But they'll have a mentor. They'll understand entrepreneurship. And they'll own their own business. And here's exactly how I'm going to do that. So I've got a program called Network of Influence, where I really just get people to collaborate whether it's online, whether it's live events, we get all kinds of cool stuff. We already have 14 events on the calendar for the rest of this year. All where our members get to come and collaborate and at the same time, half of our entire revenue in that program goes to sponsoring these kids. See, I got a TV show that we just got the green light on. Funny thing is, yes, or two days ago, we actually locked in something pretty amazing. But the show is called From Orphan to CEO. I'm teaching kids that are aging out of the foster care system how to start their own business. My company actually sponsors them. I'm an app developer, I've published over 200 mobile apps, and one of the cool things kids love is apps, right? They love apps, they understand apps, they get technology, they know how to use social media. What they need is direction. They need somebody that shows them, 
Here's the first step. Here's the books you should be reading. Here's the mentors you should be following. Here's the influencers you should be connecting with. Here's the people that can help you get business credit. Here's the investors connections. All the things that us as entrepreneurs and business professionals have at our fingertips, these kids don't even know exist. And so that's my goal. I want to help these kids understand what's helped me save my life. And so cool. all I ask is you guys maybe help along the way. Yeah, bro. Let me know. something special you have greatness within you to have a valuable resource like Manny on our team coaching us helping us providing constant value you can't you just can't get better than that I just felt so completely inspired I had no idea that this was gonna be the outcome you know I got this friend on Facebook you know Manny Lopez the guy is just absolutely amazing this guy is the man he spoke and people were just flocking to him Manny Lopez Manny the Man Lopez. I just wanted to say thank you so much for your help. I know that your services are completely needed and necessary, especially in this century, so thank you so much. You've shared with me a, such a tool to elevate and accelerate my business, and I am so grateful. 98% of text messages are read. And 98% of text wow. Compared to, at best, email, you're getting around 20%. He's a valuable consultant when it comes to marketing, when it comes to branding, and us bringing that to our members, which is phenomenal. We really help business professionals that have systems of automation that generate more leads, more referrals, and more sales. That's really if you do not have automation in your business today, you are so missing out on tons of money. Sure. You have the ability to communicate to all your users at a very, very high open rate, better than any in the industry. His apps are so innovative. I My mind was blown. Like today it has been such a great day for me, um, being able to hear Manny's story. And I'm trying not to tear up right now because I'm very emotional. You need to check him out because it's, it's going to take your, your business from here to way up here. You can't even see it up there, can you? Very influential. It's causing me to kind of rethink the way I'm doing business. So this is a guy that really knows apps inside and out. Manny just explained any problem that I have regarding marketing in a simple way and to the point. So I suggest you that contact this guy and he's just amazing. He's a god gift talent. So